Let's head right over to meteorologist Autumn Robertson with a look at the tropics and your local forecast. Yep, Candace, we really saw some decent rain today with Sally, mainly along our coastal counties. It is moving away from us and it is strengthening. Look at that convection there. As it continues to move away, we will see less impacts, even though the moisture from Sally will stick around for the next couple of days at least. And for tonight, we're still seeing some light rain, but nothing too significant out there. So nice sleeping weather out there, especially for Pinellas County, also further south, even parts of Pasco County along the coast there. Still getting some steady rain as you make a Way into the next several hours here. Precipitation wise, this is how much we received over the at least the past 48 hours here. Excuse me, my graphics here are acting up. So, decent amount of rain, especially as you get south of Pinellas County. So, Manatee County, Sarasota got around two to three inches in some areas. So, solid rain totals, of course, this wasn't significantly heavy rain. Most of that did stay offshore. Now, as Tropical Storm Sally continues to make its way into the Gulf, it will strengthen slow down just a bit and then it will approach either part of Louisiana or Mississippi making landfall somewhere around those two states as a category one storm bringing in a significant amount of rainfall. So that's pretty much the major threat. Also, storm surge will be a major threat as well as it does approach those states. So it will slow down and with that slower moving storm, it does have time to intensify and it does have time to really drop the rain, especially as it makes its way onto land. So parts of New Orleans, also parts of Alabama, Mississippi could see starting eight inches and then going way higher than that, 10 to even 15 inches locally in some areas. So that's a major threat. So we can't really get caught up with just a name, trop uh, our category one tropical storm depression. Those impacts will always be different regardless of the storm. So that's the major one. Moderate flooding is expected with Sally as we get into at least Monday and Tuesday of this week. Here's a look at the tropics. A lot going on. We have Hurricane Paulette over there and also Tropical Depression 20. So I'll focus on two of those tonight. Paulette is making its way towards Bermuda. Gusty winds, also heavy rain is expected as we get into Monday and Tuesday. And then we have Tropical Depression 20. It is expected to strengthen into a tropical storm sometime soon here. So that's going to be the next one to watch. And of course, the next storm on our list is Teddy.